Holy Bible. But you're going to send someone today for Allah. But the cartel of my salvation, the cartel of my salvation is the Holy Bible. 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 Holy Bible
welcome, good and faithful servant. Now, by the way, Edin of Sirat al Mustaqim. Edin of Sirat al Mustaqim. Nothing to do with Baal. Who came first? Muhammad or Jesus? Christianity or Islam? Who came first? I know, I know, brother. She chose to go there. Are you a Christian lady? Would you like to be a Christian? Why not? Let me ask you a question, then you can ask a question. Do you know for sure? Do you know for sure that all your sins are forgiven and you are right with God? No. But you ask me the same question. Do you know for sure that your sins are forgiven and that you are right with God? Certain person he is well, why? because we are the child of God. The Muslim, they pray, Nine times a day. If Allah is a hawk, if Allah is a sirat al mustaqim, why nine times you remind Allah? Jesus Christ said in Matthew chapter 7, verse 13, what did he say? In the year in at the straight gate, for wide is the gate, brother. Brother, one pastor, please. What is He said, In the ye in at the straight gate, for wide is the gate, and broad is the way, which lead unto destruction, and many is the be which go inside, because straight is the gate, and narrow is the way, which lead unto life, and few, only few will find it. Only few will find it. I challenge you. I challenge you. My Muslim friend, I love you. This Bible, basically, Bible is a library. Shamsi is the show. I challenge you, Shamsi. You are a coward. Come talk to me. Always Shamsi. He has a friend in Hyde Park, but he is walking alone in Shepherd Bush. I know where he lives, my friend. I love him. I am not after his soul. Always in his video, he's showing a massive, massive library of books. Why Shamsi doing that? You know why? I'll tell you why. Okay. I'll tell you why, sir. I am not an English. I am still learning English. God bless the king of England, Charles. If King Charles come to me, said Christopher, I'm going to give you the gold and silver of Great Britain. And I'm going to give you the wisdom of Cambridge and Oxford University. Come down, don't preach the gospel. I will say to the King Charles the sir, Sir, God bless you. If you give me the entire gold and silver, and if you give me the wisdom of the entire world, and I will go away with John chapter 3, verse 16. That's enough for me. This is my library. This is my library. For God so loves the world that he gave his only begotten son, that whosoever believes on him should not perish, but have eternal life, everlasting life. Now, let me finish with that statement. If Shamsi, Ali Dawa, Adnan, Muhammad Hijab, including Ahmad Didan, come to this park, the word of God, not me, the word of God will and shall destroy them. You know why? Because this is what the infallible and era word of God. The Bible basically is a library. 66 books. We got the philosophy of Paul. We got the salvation of Jesus. We got the law of Moses. We got the captain of our salvation, Jesus Christ. Therefore, we don't die for Jesus. We live and we preach the gospel of Jesus Christ. Sin is the day of John the Baptist in Matthew 11 12. And from the day of John the Baptist, the kingdom of heaven suffered violence and the violence spread by force. Let me pray for you. I love you. I love you. You. My sister, I know you are a believer, but let me tell you something. The Bible says, the Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face shine upon you and be gracious unto you. The Lord lift his count upon you and give you peace. Now I'm talking to the Christian, the official son. He says, the servant of the Lord will not strive. Did you hear that? The servant of the Lord will not strive but gentle unto all men, including Usman, including Shamsi, including Adnan, including Ali Dawa, the servant of the Lord will not strive, 
but gentle unto all men, up to preach patient. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face out upon you and be gracious unto you. The Lord lift his count upon you, mama, and give you his shalom, his peace. In Jesus' mighty name we do that. Thou art worthy, O Lord, to receive glory and honor and power. For thou hast created all things, and for thy pleasure I will create it. Amen and amen. My voice is all hallelujah. Yes, we love you. Yeah,